Hey guys, Colin from 556. My brother Dan Donegan from Disturbed. I know this has been a long time coming, but it has taken a quite some time to get Candy Apple Red uh, onto a uh, your AR. So this is definitely one of a kind. This is your initial test fire, and then we're gonna give a rundown of all the uh, specs on this bad boy with everybody that was involved. This thing is sexy, dude. Candy Apple Red, this took us quite a bit of time to get done. Um, Candy Apple Red has a, in car paint, has a gold base, and this took quite a bit of time to come up with because uh, firearms companies do not have Candy Apple Red as a base color, so we had to have the, uh, the, color, the color done for us. So I'm gonna give a rundown on this. Landtac came in and dropped in the dragon. Now, if you see, it might be upside down on it, but they did serial number four disturbed. That's pretty badass that they did that. Our friends over at Roscoe Manufacturing dropped in. They gave us the 16-inch uh, uh, M4 profile barrel that is underneath this gorgeously hidden rail. The rail came from Samson Manufacturing with a couple of the extra accessories from Samson, their little stubby grip, their hand stop as well. Our friends over at Vortex decided they were going to throw in one of their uh, Strike Eagle, the 1-6 to six by 24, which also has a, a BDC drop compensator in it, and it's illuminated. Pretty badass. Let's say thanks uh, to uh, Ruben over at Vortex for that. Our friends over at CMC with their 3.5 pound uh, flat trigger. Love those guys. They're out of the Dallas-Fort Worth area. Uh, Lantac was also in with one of their enhanced bolt carrier groups which is really considerate of them. This is sitting on our ECR billet matched upper and lower receiver uh, frame that we've got. This is topped off and finished off with our friends over at Mission First with their minimalist stock as well as their uh, V2 grip. This is just a beautiful, beautiful piece. I'm, I'm blown away because this one took a little over a year and a half to get done. Um, which is cool, we got to go see Disturbed a couple times in the interim. Um, our friend Pinstriping by Rat was who we had to shout out to to get this paintwork done for us. This Normally we do some paint uh, now in house, uh, but this was a color that we just could not pull off at 556, so we reached out to a buddy that was able to pull this off. So he was able to finish out. Dan had wanted band name, obviously, Disturbed into buttstock, which was pretty neat that he, we stuck that in there for him as well as, if you can see it, the disturbed face. And then finished out right here on the magwell with a J and a dollar sign, which is his nickname for his kiddo, which is pretty neat. His, uh, his kiddo's a big sports buff, and so he gives him the, the nickname is J Money. So it's an, pretty neat to be able to get a realistic, personalized approach to somebody's firearm. Um, and for one, multi-platinum recording artist that makes badass music. Completely stoked about this one. Dan, I know this one has been a very long time coming to get this done for you. But now it's time to get this bad boy home and get it shipped over to you. And um, I think now your buddy um, David, lead singer for Disturbed, he hit me up. And I think, I think David might want to have us do a rifle for him, which that will be another unique project that we're going to be able to do. Except it's going to be a little different because David lives in Hawaii, so we got a couple of uh, obstacles to jump through and some gun legalities to get a uh, rifle over there. But I'm looking forward to the challenge and looking forward to doing it. I'm just blown away. It's such such a beautiful rifle, guys. I am Colin from Five Five Six. I appreciate you guys.